Hello guys, I want to talk about reducing your uh, application size inside of Unreal Engine. You know, Unreal Engine is so famous of having an, a considerable amount of size when it comes to packaging your project and it's not good at all for Android devices, you know. Uh, all the applications for Android out there are around at least less than 100 megabytes when, uh, when it comes to big production games it's around 400 500 and at max one gigabyte for android devices but with unreal engine it's a little hard to get so let's kick off so the first things i want you to do is to go to your project settings actually you can uh, get to project settings right there, right there and go to Actually, you have to first set uh, have set your modes and maps, and then go to the packaging part of your project settings, uh, and then make sure to have checked this and this button here: uh, share material, shader code, and shared material native libraries. And you want to expand this menu? There's a button here. I I've just expanded it before. Like, this uh, if you wanna see how it's expanded come down to this area you have to make sure that create compressed cooked packages is checked and cook only maps is checked and you have to have specified your maps here this is very important and what other things you have to do is that exclude editor content when cooking I have to check this as well and if you don't have any movies in your project you have to check this as well if you have just don't check it but make sure that those uh, movies are included in your map somehow I mean they must be connected to something else some other contents as well in somehow I don't know it's just uh, related to you <clears throat> and what other things is that uh, if you build your package in shipping mode it, it is uh, based on Unreal Engine uh, documentations it's 40% lower in size and if you have checked these two it's less in size so uh, what else I can offer is that Uh, the next thing that you want to check is edit plugins you have to make sure that the plugins are all the plugins that you want to use not the plugins that are not being used but actually they're in the packaged content in the co cooked content and how you can uh, know that so after packaging your project file package project android or anything you have to know that already uh, go to the go to your project folder in my case this is the project folder by the way you can download my game from uh, google play so it's free, for free for android devices and I, I i would definitely recommend you to play it for sure uh, and go to saved cooked so uh, I wanna package my uh, game in etc2 mode so I'm going to check this one out actually you have to have packaged your project at least once to get these I've uh, packaged uh, my project three times in three different modes and I have this other folders as well but doesn't matter you package your project once and you will get something some folder and you will go to the folder like this so the first thing I want to do inside of here is as I show as I've shown you is the plugin so go to the engines plugins and there are some plugins these are really cooked into the project into the size that you're seeing these are responsible for the size so you have to get rid of them somehow and if you are using them just don't play with them don't mess with them don't mess up your project uh, actually what <laughs> i forgot to say it's so important it's a very important after the last resort this is actually the last resort 
before actually the last resort you have to get a copy of your project just make a backup of it grab a copy and put it somewhere safe just make sure that you, if you mess up you wouldn't get regretful you you would have something to get back to to start from that project not start, starting from scratch or uh, you know what I mean just make a backup get a copy so the first thing is that paper 2d I I'm not using paper 2d at all it's a project it's a, a plugin for uh, 2d games mostly actually there's a uh, if you sh uh, go to the plugins as I've shown you edit plugins plugin uh, show only enabled and if you search here paper to the add tools and assets to help create 2d games blah 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 so disable it as simple as that i don't want it and i don't really use it so this is the first thing that i had uh, disabled so the next thing is speed tree importer so i don't really use speed tree so i really don't need it so what's the better option than disable it speed tree disable check so the next thing that i have to uh oh, i'll call it yeah, do no not at all my game's not vr so yeah and uh, after doing so you have to restart your engine actually after after you've done uh, you finished deleting the assets, deleting actually the plugins that you don't want Restart your engine and while it's restarting I'm gonna pause the video for some seconds Great, now that the editor is restarted there's something else that I have to tell you uh, After having all the uh, not necessary plugins disabled the other thing that you have to do uh, inside of saved cooked and under the etc do or whatever leg uh, you want to go to the folder other than the engine in my case it's legacy of tracer <coughs> so there there are some things here uh, so these are the shaders that I really can't do anything about because I'm using Vulkan I'm using e e e es3.1 uh, so go to the content and look what you've got here I've got an asset which is 2 megabytes which is so insanely high 2.66 it's just a texture I have to optimize this somehow you know so this is not the worst case though the worst case that you could find is somewhere here this is just a texture, texture and it's 10 megabytes or something 10 to 11 yeah 10.6 I have to uh, optimize this thing so the way I optimize it is to, is to inside of my content go to the best assets exactly like the folders here and uh, this is it uh, ch0210001 ca yeah exactly this one so the way I do it is to right click and uh, asset actions export I want to export it to somewhere that I don't really care where it just doesn't matter uh, maybe inside the videos I don't really know uh, yeah so the video and, uh, yeah, right click edit. Actually, I don't want to edit it with Photoshop or something. Asset action again, export. I want it to be a bitmap, a Windows bitmap. So, again, because Photoshop is like too slow for me, I just want to use the paint, you know, use the easiest one, uh, easiest way possible. So, edit. Now here comes the paint, the most powerful yet. So what I really want to do is 
that if the, this computer lets me to do that. Yeah, actually, this is wasting too much now. Uh, hit the resize button. Actually, I want it to be like 20. We don't want more in an, in an Android game, you know. And save as JPEG. D and inside of my project. Uh, content and it was in base assets I believe and I want it to be with uh, diffuse some other name so again go to the best assets import you have something that is much much less sizable just I want to just show you how better this is mm. Yeah, it's 164 kilobytes. Whereas this thing is around 19 megabytes, which is so high for a for an Android game. You have to optimize these things, and the way I do that is just to go here, uh, to go to the material, it's just the project is so heavy. So this is the diffuse that I had used. I want to delete it and use the new diffuse texture. And I'm I have to do it for each of every one of these textures. This is very important. This makes a lot of uh, difference in the game. So just do it. Don't be lazy. Just do it. Uh, don't find any unreasonable excuses, just do it. So, uh, other things that we could find is, uh, you know, the way is simple. The uh, way that you could do this, you could optimize your stuff, is so simple. Just go to saved, cooked, Android, just, just search, search and anything that is higher than normal just optimize them if it's like uh, this is high I can just uh, optimize it better with blender there's this uh, plugin for blender for uh, having all the mixemo assets better optimized more optimized for unreal engine you can use all of this you know you can google search everything to optimize them better and more I have some pretty bad stuff, pretty nasty stuff here in the environment, I have to optimize all of this, you know, the uh, problem uh, is that the textures are too big and sometimes the assets, 3D assets are too big and as I told you, I could solve them with Build Blender or any other technique, just don't know, it's the last resort that you could do with your game to get a better, reasonable uh, size for your game to have the have more clients downloaded the, your game this is very important and by the way this is my game if you haven't played it yet if you haven't experienced it yet you can experience it for free for your Android devices yeah. this is really good this looks really good you can do a lot of stuff a lot of parkour stuff uh, yeah, this is it. I hope you, you have enjoyed it and I hope you are experiencing a great day today and a great week. Yeah, cheers.